I got a question for you guys. What's the best law? So if you're not doing pop, what do you call it? Toaster, toaster law? Toaster pop law? Then what That's are you doing? Like what, what is the, what's the one when someone walks in, you're like, jackpot. Like this is, this is <laughs> yeah, I'm going to make some bank off this. I, mean, I do think that everybody, I mean, every lawyer is one case away from retirement anytime. Like my dad drove for UPS his whole life. Yeah. And if you have a UPS driver that everybody knew was drunk, he was drinking on the job, he hit somebody in a quadriplegic that had 12 kids, or hit somebody that was legally crossing the crosswalk, made a quadriplegic that had 12 kids. Yeah. You can that's retire. The, that's the one, like the Tracy Morgan case. Oh, that was, that was the New Jersey. One. I know the people that were on that case. Yeah. Do you think um, he was faking it? Like, cause he was out I of the game. I think he was faking it. Man. I think he was. I've seen him on. I've he heard him on Howard Stern after that, and he's like, "That was Walmart, not Walgreen, motherfucker." <laughs> You know, yeah. it's like, how much money did you get? He goes, well, it was Walmart. Let me say this. I know some people involved in it on the, on the victim side, not the law side. And they were advised to not be online, not do anything till the case. So basically they would just hid. But here's knowing the that they would get a so, so here's the thing with a guy like Tracy Morgan. Like yeah. it's got to be a really fucking big number for him not to like pursue his career for like three years. Yeah, it was a big number. Well, they were like, I dude, this is Walmart. Well, you're yeah. going to get paid. Yeah, no, it's Walmart. Yeah. Interesting. But there were some smaller comics, too, that it's worth it to not be on your Instagram. Oh, for sure. It was, they were all on a bus, right? There was like a bus of them. Like a limo. It was a crazy limo. limo guy. I would try to do it, but I wouldn't be capable. I could hide yeah. for like, I'm like not good with that kind of stuff. Like, I'll go camping. I'll be like, I need the woods. You know, I could see myself being out here for well, a year. You, well, it's good to get away from my you phone. You could go camping if you've been injured. I mean, you just can't like, you know, maybe go to the gym and be like doing like. No, I was using this as an example. Yeah. Like, I'm the type of guy who will go camping and then be like, I could be out here for a year. And then like after 12 hours, I'm like, where's my cell phone? We got to get to a Starbucks. Like, I, I romanticize about those things. So I think <laughs> that I would person. try to be off the grid to Won't have. get the biggest payout in the lawsuit, but then I just wouldn't be able to do it. For we, uh, Mar, we've I've had two, two, I've had uh, one day in the last what, 20 years where I was forced to not have a cell phone for 20, 18 hours maybe. And it was- That's hard. It was Terrible. tough, man. I went to the Masters this year in nice. Augusta, Georgia, oh, they right? Oh, you lock it up. So Masters, big bucket list thing for golfers. I play golf. I, I love Masters. With yeah, a yeah. bunch of my friends. The Masters, they don't allow cell phones mm. into the tournament, right? And I was there for Masters Sunday, you know, the yeah, final like round. That. Got there 9 in the morning, didn't leave till 6 p.m. after Scotty Scheffler was fucking host, you know, drinking booze out of the trophy on the fucking 18th green. So I was there like 18 hours or something. Long fucking day, right? Yeah. 12 hours at least. No cell phone. They make you leave it in like, a, they lock it up and stuff. And I was fucking weird, you know, I felt weird with it. It is weird. And also you shouldn't feel bad about it being weird. Yeah. So like people always go like, oh, I would love to get away from my phone. But it's like also like you, there's a reason you like it. Everything's in there. Well, your yeah. career's in there. Your wife's in there. Your friends are in there. Like you're like strangers, your, your, your dreams. Like well, our own, phones have everything. Well, at, at the, at the like fucking tournament, at, at the tournament, I'm not walking just around. Candy Crush and walking around like, this there's a ton big of golf course, right? Walking around this big fucking golf course. I don't know where the fucking holes are. Yeah. I don't know what the hell's going on. They got like three hand like change scoreboards like Wrigley Field oh, yeah, yeah. where they put up a shit where if the guy made a birdie or whatever, like, like three of them on the whole course. So nobody knows who's winning, right. who's losing, what's going on at home. I watch a golf tournament, you know, I got, the, I got like my phone, I got the screen, I can see who's winning, yeah. who's making a birdie, <laughs> who's choking like a dog. You know why they don't the Masters let you have are just wandering phone. around going, what the fuck's going on? Control. You know why they don't let you have your phone at the Masters? That way you got an out for your wife. Like, dude, they don't let us have our. You know, I've gone to the Masters every year. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, honey, I don't, <laughs> honey, I don't know what to tell you. It was, I was at this very exclusive golf course with no cameras or anything for 12 hours, and they didn't let me have a phone, so I don't know what to tell you. Yeah.